Come on, Eve, drink the poison punch. Drink it and die before Julian can divorce me to marry you. You can't stay away from me, can you, Liz? No, it's not enough that you cost me the love of my husband and my daughters. No, you want to see me lose my license to practice medicine, too. I can make this real simple for you, Liz. Just get away from Eve so she can drink the punch and die. There you go again, Eve. Accusing me of ruining your life when you did that yourself. You were the one who left home seeking fame and fortune, only to find men and drugs. You had the child out of wedlock. A son who wound up committing incest with his half-sister. Yes, I made mistakes when I was young. But I never meant to hurt anyone. And I tried to make up for it by becoming a doctor. Right. A doctor who lied and kept secrets. And when they finally came out, ruined lives. No, that was your doing. You're the one who got Aunt Irma to expose my past. I've had to live with my past, Eve. I think it's only fair that you live with yours. And now you are. You are finally suffering the consequences, just like I suffered the consequences when you abandoned me to be abused by my father. Oh, God, Liz, not that again. Forgive me, Eve. I am sorry that my being molested night after night for years on end annoys you. No, Liz, it's your harping on something that I've apologized for a million times that annoys me. I would not have left you behind had I known you were going to be molested. Yes, but you did leave me behind, and because of that, I was molested. Well, however badly scarred you were, it certainly hasn't kept you from sweating up the sheets with TC, now has it? Oh, damn it! Now what am I gonna do? How am I going to get an eat alone so I can poison her? Ah. Excuse me. Excuse me. Um, Father Lundin is about to begin uh, the ceremony, so why don't we go upstairs and have a seat, okay? Yes, thank you. Uh, shut up. Well, you wanted my life and you destroyed me to get it. So now you're living in my house, cozying up to my daughters. You're just upset because T.C. asked me to marry him. And I put him in one way to step up for the children. Please, don't give a damn about T.C. or the girls. All you care about is hurting me. <coughs> oh. I bet it's killing you living up at the Crane Mansion with your sugar daddy. <coughs> Finally, Eve is gonna drink up and drop dead. <coughs> Honestly, Eve is gonna die of dehydration before I can poison her. made everyone so uncomfortable they all left what a shame yes it is a shame I remember when everyone looked at me with respect that's all over thanks to you my pleasure you know what Liz just go away I don't want to talk to you anymore well that's fine Eve because you can listen because I am not through with you yet put her glass right next to Eve. I mean, what if they reach for the wrong cup? I could kill the wrong sister. Liz, you can talk till you're hoarse, but I am through listening to you growl and snarl. Oh, don't go getting high and mighty with me. I can have you arrested for threatening me. Oh, no. Oh, no, what if Liz picks up the wrong cup? I know what. I'll pretend that I just got here. I'll run in there, and I'll just bump into them and spill out the poison. Yeah. Oops, too late. <coughs> oh my 
Oh my God. And Julian, where is Eve? I need to talk to her about her threatening Liz. She's in the basement having a glass of punch. She is? Yes, why? Well, Liz went downstairs to get something to drink, too. Oh my God, we should go down there before this trouble. What is it, Rebecca? She, she's dead. 